What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Dr. Goon. And today, this video is actually kind of a precursor to a longer conversation that will be had on podcast, my Dr. Goon show, where me and GB will be discussing several current topics. Um, and this is one of them because me, me and him, and one of the reasons, you know, I think my podcast with GB and my videos when I, whenever I do collab with him are so good is me and him often disagree. Uh, it leads to funny discourse, but this is one of those few occasions where we're both on the exact same page. This move by the MCU or Marvel Cinematic Universe is disgusting. They deserve to burn for this. How they are desecrating and violating the Fantastic Four is of a biblical nature. But before we continue with this rant of mine, smash the like button. Let's get it to 300 plus likes. If you guys enjoy the way I talk about certain topics, such as the MCU, Marvel, DC, other comic book stuff, anime, manga, all that, show love in the comments and with the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. I am Dr. Goon, uh, formerly known as Jobbers and Goons and about 37 other names. I like to change my name, but I think Dr. Goon fits me the most and this will stay that way for the foreseeable future. Also check out my Discord where we do games, prizes, D&Ds, giveaways, and more. Now getting back into this, what did they do? That pissed me off so bad because viewers discretion advised I'm about to say some real shit, okay? So I want to preface with saying this attack I'm about to undergo has nothing to do with the actress herself, okay? I actually appreciate this actress for what she's done. I've seen her in one thing, and that was Ozark, which, by the way, if you have not seen the show Ozark, 10 out of 10, shit's fucking gas, okay? Go check it out. I've actually done a video on Marty Bird before against um, my guy from Breaking Bad. Uh, Heisenberg. So definitely check that out. Check out the show. It's actually fantastic. However, casting her for this is absurd. So if you guys did not see the Fantastic Four movie, the producers, whoever the fuck is behind this disaster, they've been updating us on casting and roles. I already came out. I think I talked about it on one podcast, but I definitely at the bare minimum community posted it. And I definitely talked about it in my Discord server. Their casting for the Fantastic Four is dog shit. Why the fuck is 97 year old Pedro Pascal playing Reed Richards? What the hell is going on? We're going to have a geriatric Dr. Doom to match that because obviously they're arrivals since college. But it's shit's ridiculous. Like, I don't get the casting at all. It's terrible casting. And people are like, oh, that's going to be a good Ben Grimm. Bitch, Ben Grimm was special forces, a college football demigod. Like, the lack of knowledge on who Ben Grimm should be portrayed as is disgusting. But I digress. So they already pissed me off there, right? I was like, okay, Fantastic Four is going to be hot dog water most likely like, we need to be embracing that idea early so we don't get upset when it drops we should anticipate it being ass because worst case if it's semi ass at least we're a little on the happy side right we're like oh this isn't complete shit it's just a little shit you know like that's that's better than i guess the complete shit we expected but no they they did far worse so they decided to turn silver surfer into a female for the movies that's right. They want to make Norn Rad a bitch, which is ironic because Norn Rad is a bitch. <laughs> but if you guys don't know, I've historically shit on Silver Surfer for being a jobber on this channel. Now, him being a jobber will not stop me from telling the truth, okay? Norn Rad, the Silver Surfer, is an integral part of the Fantastic Four lore. They are the ones that saved him, essentially, from becoming just this mindless brute that rides around for Galactus and picks random places for him to eat. When they ran down, when he first ran up on the Fantastic Four, he was like, I, this planet's got plenty of nutrients for my boy Big G. Fuck this planet. I'm not even a human anyway. Let them get cooked. Ben Grimm saw him and said, whoa, I know he's not talking crazy on my block. Y'all know Ben Grimm's a fucking man. So what do he do? Knocked his ass out, right? Let Silver Surfer know, hey, ain't no bitches on Earth, okay? We're going to do you dirty if you try this stupid shit. And that was the start of a beautiful dynamic between Silver Surfer and the Fantastic Four. The spacefaring scout for Galactus, Nornrad, 
as a man, as a character, developed throughout the years based on, on his encounters with Fantastic Four, his work for Galactus, and what he's had to do in the 616 universe. It's it's really a pretty damn good narrative um, on how his character was built. You know, you can't you can't really take away Norn Rad Silver Surfer from the Fantastic Four. They go together as infamously Galactus was introduced through the Fantastic Four, and conversely, so is Norn Rad. And whether you think he's a bum, whether you think he's the dopest character ever, one shot Superman, all that shit. Silver Surfer Norn Rad is a key piece to their lore. And to just say, fuck it, let's let's make Norn Rad a country bitch. Like, that's crazy to me. And again, love this actress in Ozarks. But Ozarks is also some backwater shit. She's perfect for that country redneck killer role, right? Like, that's what she was amazing for. That's what she... Roles like that she should be casted for. But to be casted as Norn Rad Silver Surfer, but we're going to make Norn a girl. What the hell are we doing, MCU? I'm not even appealing to like some woke bullshit because I don't care if this decision was woke. What I care is this decision was fucking terrible. OK, who are you appealing to with this? Women? Women want to be Norn Rad now? Spoiler alert, uh, women out there that are going to be inspired by this. Norn Rad gets his ass beat every Tuesday. So being Silver Surfer is not exactly a winning role, okay? You are a slave to Galactus that has to go around and find planets for him to eat, okay? You want women to be slaves now? Crazy, big if true MCU. That's right, I put you in that fucking moral dilemma. I introduced that idea right now. Change your casting. I, hey, I could never be as big of a bum as Silver Surfer. But I would, I'd much rather myself play him in the MCU than for them to change him into a female with a country accent. Maybe they'll have her do voice training to not sound country. They'll try to get her. I, I don't, guys, I don't know what the fucking plan is, to be honest. Maybe that's why I'm so upset. Maybe that's why I'm so angry. Like, why would you do this? Why would you change one of the core pieces to the Fantastic Four lore, introduce it in the first movie where we're introducing the Fantastic Four and its purity to the MCU? You already messed up the Fantastic Four casting where we just like, hey, fuck it. Let's just mess up the whole casting. It's, it's, that's ridiculous. Like, this is an absurd cast. This is like picking Nicki Minaj to play Wolverine. What the hell are we doing? There, are, Sure, there's other heralds to Galactus, but you don't make them Norn Rad. You don't make them Silver Surfer. There's something else entirely. They are different heralds. You don't fucking introduce the Fantastic Four and make Galactus's Norn Rad Silver Surfer a woman. That's ridiculous. Especially a country woman. What are we doing? And she's like two feet tall. So you went out of your way. You're going to have to make her look taller because I'm telling you, if a midget Silver Surfer runs up on Ben Grimm, that's a bad day because regular Silver Surfer is getting the hands anyway. Like, this is an absurd casting. This is legitimately, I can't recall a worse casting for the MCU. If there has been a worse casting, get in the comment section down below and let me know which casting I forgot to mention. Maybe I'll pin it or I'll definitely heart it. I heart most comments anyway. But let me know what you guys think of this tomfoolery. Of course, me and GB will be going back and forth on this among other topics on our podcast, which hopefully we do today or tomorrow. But this was some bullshit I had to talk about. Absolutely absurd. MCU, the way you have massacred my boy. Fantastic Four Ben Grimm. The way you've massacred Norrin Rad. The way you massacred the casting for the rest of them. The MCU deserves to burn for this bullshit. This is ridiculous. I cannot stand it. I think it's a terrible look. It's a terrible idea. Again, I don't care if it's some woke BS they're trying to get to. Regardless, shit is shit, okay? For whatever reason, I don't care about the reason. We're here. We have to deal with the ramifications of this bullshit. It's ridiculous. This is worst casting ever. And I hate that because... The actress is going to get a lot of hate for this when she herself was fantastic in Ozarks. She was amazing, like legit. She she was one of the bright spots on the show that was already fantastic in itself. So sucks for her. Sucks for all of us for having to acknowledge we have to deal with this moving forward and that this is going to be put on the screen in front of us. Fuck that. Fuck this casting. Fuck the Fantastic Four movie. Marvel, call me. 
I'll fix this shit for you, okay? And I'll make a solo Ben Grimm movie because that's what the streets need. But let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Make sure to like and subscribe. And if you're one of the few crackheads that enjoyed this casting, let me know why in the comment section down below because I need to understand the line of thinking. But yeah, anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoy my content. I'm looking forward to dropping on a consistent basis. But yeah, anyways, been your boy, Dr. Goon. And I'll see y'all later. Peace.